I'm Alex for Teach Like This, and this is a lineup, also known as Inside Outside Circle. Depending on the space in your classroom, the size, the number of students, etc., you may want to do one or the other, but both these strategies are the exact same thing. This strategy allows students to get up out of their seats and share their ideas with other classmates. Your students will be paired with a variety of partners throughout the length of this activity. Just be forewarned, students might be a little bit confused the first time you do it, but once they get the hang of it, and they'll get the hang of it quickly, it'll be a very smooth activity. So what do you need to do? Let me tell you. Start by preparing questions or prompts so that students see ahead of time. Try to avoid questions that have short answers. Student discussion is the key here. Give the students the questions ahead of time, so that way they can think about it and jot down notes that they can use later. Next, have the students line up in two parallel lines that face each other. The person that the student is making eye contact with will be their partner. Next, ask students to refer to their first prompt and begin talking it out. Then ring a bell or have some other sort of strategy that signals to students it's time to switch. All the students in one line will begin moving down one, and the last person will go to the start, then repeat the process. While students are interacting, go up and down the line and listen to their responses. This is a great way to check for understanding. The lineup activity becomes an inside-outside circle activity by just changing the shape and how students move. For example, this is how an inside-outside circle activity would work. Also, keep in mind a couple examples to be able to use when you close the activity later. Just to reiterate, it's important to ask higher order level questions. If you ask low level questions of students, the conversation and dialogue just won't be there. That's all for this video. If you have additional questions, connect with me on Twitter, by email, or by commenting down below. And subscribe for weekly strategies in your newsfeed. I'm Alex, and that's Teach Like This.